I got my wine glass because I'm here to talk my SHIT about this wine that I got from Whole Foods. Do not let these Whole Foods companies fool you. They be charging $4 for wine and the wine be trash money. Okay? I am not lying. I cannot even drink. It took, it's literally taking me two weeks to drink this whole entire bottle because I am like, what in the F is this? So, <laughs> before we get into that, I don't want to make sure you guys are subscribed to my channel. So, go ahead right now and subscribe to my channel. And if this is your first time clicking this video, welcome to the TJ fam. Be sure to subscribe before you go. And hit the bell right next to the subscribe button so you know every time I post a video. And if you are yet again clicking another one of my videos, thank you so much for being such a loyal subscriber. I truly appreciate you. And while you're there, <laughs> be sure to give this video a big thumbs up because why not, okay? But let's get into the video, guys. So in this video, as you can see, I, I have already opened this bottle up. This is three, three Wishes Chardonnay. So a while ago around Christmas, Thanksgiving, this was about $3.99. I hear something, but I'm not sure what it is. <laughs> Please ignore me, guys. I'm tweaking over here. I'm tweaking, tweaking. But around Christmas, New Year's Day, this brand, literally Three Wishes, was $3.99 at Whole Foods. So I thought, let me grab a couple of them. So I ended up getting about four or five bottles. And I was highly upset because I was like, WTF, what is I'm drinking? For one, they already didn't have Pinot Noir. And we know Pinot Noir is my favorite. I can go all night and I can drink Pinot Noir back to back to back. Just throwing it back. So I thought, let me take some time out and let me try the Chardonnay. Y'all, y'all. Now y'all know I ain't gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie to y'all about this one because <sighs> I was very, 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 very disappointed. So I'm going to try it on, on the camera for you guys so you guys can know that I'm not lying. This is the rest of it because, again, it took me two weeks to finish this bottle. Y'all know, girls, it don't take no two weeks to finish a bottle of mine. But if it tastes like this, it may take you a goddamn month. But you ain't here for me, okay? You did not hear from me. <laughs> so let's talk about this Chardonnay. I'm not too sure. I'm not even going to lie. Let me say, be straight up, disclaimer, whatever, how you feel. Judge me or not, but I'm not too sure how Chardonnay is supposed to taste. So I can't really say if it does or does not taste like Chardonnay, but I definitely can say that it does not taste good. Okay? So let me know, comment, and let me know if Chardonnay, don't, Chardonnay, Chardonnay does not taste good. Because this here does not taste good. No. Actually, you know what? After sitting, and I guess after some for some days after sitting for some days it definitely tastes better and it tastes better warm than it does cold if you have this in your refrigerator and you take it out thinking you finna drink this it's not gonna be good it does not taste good cold i would just say that and again it still is not the best but actually it tastes so much better right now than it has my other glasses when i drank the other rest of the bottle i am not lying to you i can guarantee you this tastes a thousand times better than it did before and now you know it could be because i had it sitting on the table waiting on me to record it so i had it was no top on it it was no nothing it was just out open and sitting there collecting all the air in the in the room so that could have made it taste differently you, you, you never know okay you never know But yeah, no. I mean, it may be the aftertaste that I'm not really a big fan of. But it's just not for me. Like this, this is just not, not, not for me. All right, guys. So I'm going to go ahead and finish this up. Well, I'm going to finish taking another sip of this and then finish, to the, finish it later. Again, guys, this is not me saying that I don't like it or I do like it. I have like mixed feelings about this because I do not like it cold. And I like it much better when it's warm or room temperature. Again, don't get me wrong. You're probably going to be like, of course, duh, T. It was $4. Duh. That's probably why it tastes like this because it costs $4. But you really never really know. I just want you guys to get a heads up. Do you guys want to waste 
you guys gonna be like, oh crap, that's four dollars, and you're gonna end up mad twenty five dollars for it, but then you're gonna be mad because now you gotta drink all those bottles that are not good. Okay. But yeah, guys, I don't wanna say that I don't like you, I don't wanna say that I do like you. I just wanna let you guys know my thoughts, okay? So moving forward from the Chardonnay, we're gonna talk about a different a different type of wine. It's the same exact brand, it's the three wishes. It's three wishes, same one, Cabernet Sauvignon, same thing, three wishes. So this one, here's the tea. I have not had this in the refrigerator since I got this, and I'm literally just opening this right now. So I'm going, uh-oh, look at my wine glass. Yeah, I can't keep up with nothing. I'm like the clumsiest person in the world. Like, it's holding on, it's holding on strong. It's broke though. Then he, so let's pour a little bit up on here. See what we thinking. See what we thinking. Smells smells like grapes. <laughs> grape grapes. Does that make sense? Purple grapes. Grape grapes. <laughs> Whatever. Don't judge me, how. This isn't bad for four dollars. It's not bad. It does have that dry aftertaste that the Chardonnay did not have. The Chardonnay has a weird kind of aftertaste that I preferably would rather not. Just with this specific brand. Again, this specific brand, I would rather not have Chardonnay. But this is not bad, actually. I can actually sit and enjoy this. And it probably wouldn't even be bad if it was kind of cool. So I would say this is something that you can buy for four dollars. Get the Cabernet Sauvignon. Let me know if I'm pronouncing it wrong, cause you know y'all know I'd be crazy. But definitely get this. Do not get the Chardonnay if you want to buy some cheap wine. If you need some cooking wine or something, and you want to drink the rest of it, this is the go-to wine. Do not get the Chardonnay because you're gonna be mad. Okay. Yeah, guys. This is the one. Yeah, I was kind of upset that they didn't have the Pinot Noir because the Pinot Noir probably would have been pretty decent. I never had really a bad brand of wine that is particularly Pinot Noir. So I would probably guess that their Pinot Noir is probably decent as well. But you never really know, okay? You never really know unless you try it. So if you guys have tried this out, three wishes, let me know what you guys think. I was going to get the Pinot Grigio one, but I'm not really a huge fan of Pinot Grigio like that. I kind of want to. It's like an acquired taste. So, I guess you know what? That's what the Chardonnay probably is. Chardonnay, when people drink Chardonnay, it has to be an acquired taste. So, maybe if I want it sometimes, like I'm eating a salad, like a steak salad or something like that, I'm going to drink some Chardonnay with it. Ah, who knows? Because when in fact, I'll probably order some Pinot Noir. You never really know because I'm basic and I like Pinot Noir a lot. <laughs> Who knows? Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. But yeah, guys, this is fire for sure, for sure. If you want to get one of these cheap wines, definitely get this. Like I said, I, will, I can definitely go ahead and drink this. After work one day, a little cheap, some cheap. I could drink the rest of this probably before I go to bed. You never really know. So if I tap on again with you guys and we talking about something, I'm giving you a story time. And I got this bottle in my hand still. Don't judge me because y'all know I'm crazy, okay? <laughs> and that is that, guys. That is me talking about the wine that I do not like. Well, I'm not going to say I don't like. I'm just indifferent about it. And the wine that I can go with and if it's for it dollars. Okay? And as you know, beautiful people, I'm Tara J, and I'm out. Peace.